Hey guys, some new numbers came out from the Federal Housing Finance Agency with regards to the house price index and how it relates July to August and then year over year as well. So I know the numbers are a little bit behind from where we are. We now have September data, but I just wanted to compare where Nashville and the surrounding counties are sitting compared to where uh, the entire U.S. housing market is set. Uh, according to the FHFA. So um, if we look at July to August uh, from the house pricing index, uh, they came down, house prices came down 0.7% from July to August, but they're still up year over year at 11.9%. Okay, so that's kind of the baseline. If we remember the US, if we look at the US as a whole, it's typically, it's typically around the 17th to 19th state and Tennessee's always been near the top five. Nashville, which Nashville for this is usually uh, Greater Nashville, which is uh, Murfreesboro down to Franklin and back up to Nashville as well for this report. So um, again, 0.7% down uh, monthly and then up 11.9% year over year. So if we look at some numbers for Davidson County, we are down from July to August 3% yet we're up 18.2% year over year. Uh, Williamson County, we are down 9% uh, from July to August, but we're up 7.5%. I know those numbers don't sound great, so I looked into the future and saw that from August to September monthly, we're back up 10.9%, and year over year is up 26% uh, for Williamson County by the time we get to September in the future. Rutherford County, we're looking at a negative 1.8% month, uh, month over month, so from uh, July to August, and then up 21.7%. Sumner County is uh, up 0.33% uh, July to August, and then year over year is 21.9% positive. Uh, Wilson County, we are negative 2.6% July to August and yet we are up 17.9% house prices year over year. Uh, Cheatham County, we are up 10% July to August, uh, and we are up year over year 27.1%. So shout out to Cheatham County. And then last but not least, Grundy County. Now I did hear that a lot of these houses went in the Grundy County auction. Uh, a lot of buyers saw something they just had to have uh, even though their mind told them they should proceed with caution, uh, his heart said, go ahead and make a bid on that. Um, so, Grand Grundy County, uh, July to, my kids love that song. July to August, uh, down 21%, and then year over year, though, up 16%. So, um, that's how our area compares with the U.S. housing market, according to the FHFA. Um, if you guys enjoyed this video, go ahead and like, share, subscribe, and uh, I'll see you again soon.